I'm embarrassed. Mm-hmm. I'm so embarrassed. I'm sitting sitting in my car comp- complete complaining comp huh? Complating. Complete completing. What? Complaining. Complete. Complaint. What? Comp- that you um you had you 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 could you do you you want compilating 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 what what compilating compilating completing wait what <laughs> wait complaining comp comp I was just gonna see if I could grab your number. I'll be giving out my number for free. Oh, it costs to get your number? How much we talking? Solid. What? She belongs to the streets. Ni ni merara na wana ume erfu saba mi tatu. Seven thousand. Seven thousand three hundred men's in a period of ten years. Merara na wana ume erfu saba mi tatu. In a period of ten years. Yo kitu na uruku na esabu. Sikuwa na hesabu juu. Yaani mimi mwenyewe nikipiga hesabu yangu juu. Sometimes ungelala hata na wanaume hata kumi, hata 15 siku moja. Hata kama wewe ni mgonjwa mimi sitaki kujua. I'll translate for those of you who don't understand Swahili because she's speaking a mixture of Swahili and English. Now this woman claims to have had sex with 7300 men in 10 years and she averaged 10 to 15 guys a day. What? 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 Yeah. Man, look at man, hell now. <laughs> God damn it. You can't make this shit up. Guys, kindly strap up and be safe out there. I must be pretty weak-willed because all it took was falling in love with a man and now I'm like not really I mean I'm a feminist but like kind of I don't really need my maiden name. I don't really need it. I like your last name better anyway. Like I'll just take that. I know he can do his own laundry. I know that he can clean the house, but I want to do it for him. I want to cook all his meals. I want to make sure he's getting all his whole grains, all his vegetables. I want to make sure he's getting all that protein. He has not asked any of this of me. It just kind of naturally kicks in. Like these instincts just kind of come out of like, "Oh, now I have to take care of you when you're sick." Oops, I made you breakfast and it fits all of your dietary requirements. My bad. I think I got possessed by a housewife. I... Now she's not weak-willed and she's not been possessed by a housewife. I'll explain. When a man is in his masculine, a woman just reverts to being in her feminine role. And this particular woman wants to be fit, feminine, friendly. She wants to be caring and nurturing, and she wants to take care of her man. But the vast majority of modern women have been sold the lie that is feminism. They've been told that they are strong, independent women. They don't need men. But the fact of the matter is, men need women. Women need men. We complement each other. We are better for each other. It's facts. It's facts. It's not facts. These sizes are not facts. Women will go out like here and let a nigga fuck them raw, without putting no ring on it, nothing. But you draw the line and make it a sandwich for a man. What in the fuck is going on? I take pride in doing my womanly duties. I feel like a man should never have to tell me to do certain shit that I just already should naturally be doing. Like that's an embarrassment. If a man gotta tell me to clean up, you should. I should feel embarrassed, correct? Like if my man is hungry. If that's my man, if I'm around here claiming that this is my man, this is who I want to be with or whatever, and my man is hungry, I'm going to get my ass up and I'm going to go cook. But that's because that's what I want to do for my man and I know that that's what makes it like I'm pretty sure that he will be happy. Y'all don't like to see y'all man happy? Are you a virgin? Yes. And how old are you? I'm 21. Why haven't you done the deed yet? The key to a strong society is family. And so in my view, choosing my future husband is like the most important decision I'll ever make and I'm somebody that I know my heart and I know that I fall really hard when I meet somebody so I want to uh, retain some level of objectivity when I'm selecting a future partner and I know that if I had sex with them I would be completely imprinted on them and I instead of being like okay is this person do they have the qualities that I'm looking for in a husband or am I just making like making it work instead of like seeing red flags and leaving. Is there any reason why you're dressed so modestly instead of revealing like most women tend to do when they come out to Miami? I mean, this is just my personal sense of style. I just think it's respectful to others and to my future partner 
um, and to myself to just cover myself up more. I know that I, you know, take care of myself. I'm pretty athletic, but I don't need to have that on display. Okay, PSA to all men. Just because a girl is wearing a low-cut shirt or a tight top or a fitted outfit doesn't give you permission to just stare at their chest. It makes us so uncomfortable, and if you guys could please stop doing it, it would be amazing. Men will always be like, oh, we don't like being called creeps or we're so scared to be called creeps, but then you guys make it so difficult for the female species to exist or even... <laughs> Women. <laughs> is it cheating if you're in a relationship and someone else buys you gifts while you're in a relationship? You no. Know. Would you accept the gifts? Absolutely. If you had a man, is it okay if a girl buys him gifts? You know what? It's not okay because it's misleading. So would you accept the gifts or no? Yeah, they're free. I'll translate the womanese. It's only okay when she does it, but it's wrong when he does it. Jesus can't save these hoes. Why are you trying? Technically, I'm single, but I'm also dating a tree. Are you delusional? Do, are, do you suffer from a mental illness? Yeah. A tree. A tree. What? Yeah. A tree. Is Can you it boost a the tree? audio? A tree. <laughs> what does that mean, a tree? Um, there's just a big tree. Down Is this tree consensual? Yeah. Oh, okay. And we're talking trees tree. consent. This is actually real. saying the <laughs> what type uh, of tree? What's tree's is government it? name? There's an there's a philia for that, isn't there? What is the what yeah. is it called? There's a feeling. A I'm waiting for him to tell me his name. No, no, there's an actual. I don't remember <laughs> what it is. I feel like there's a. Do you a have like a But there's a philia for tree. What kind of like what kind of tree? Like physical. Hey guys, one one mic at a time, please. Okay. What kind of tree? I don't know. I have no idea what he is. You have to learn more about him, and then you're in a relationship with well, her. And she'll tell you I give him like little kisses, and then you you said it was a he. How do you know the gender of the um, tree? I believe most trees are, are at least. In well, America. I guess actually, yeah, yeah, there are male and female trees. Yeah. Actually, fruit trees are female trees. They're depollinators, and male trees are pollinators. Are you certain that it's like? What if it identifies as a they though? <laughs> that's a great. That's a valid question. You know, I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> and do you have like a physical relationship with the tree? Like I give him kisses, like I kiss my hand and then I press it on him. Are yeah. you being serious right now? I am so dead ass. I believe you. I'm taking on the like a guy to go like see this Wait, tree with me. Another, you took another guy to see your tree? How did yeah. the Why? tree feel about that yeah, yeah I, I think mean, that's inappropriate i didn't introduce him as like i'm hanging out with this guy i think the you tree is jealous I, mean? <laughs> I think the tree is jealous this, we're gonna get into this this is yeah. juicy um juicy stuff. <laughs> how did you get into that me i just like nature so I, to okay. me it's just like i saw Would him down marry? the street i was like damn he looks really pretty <laughs> how soon is it how early can we walk out of this podcast <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, I'm so I'm just being dead ass with you guys. By the way, what is dead ass? I mean, and what is serious? I get it. Oh, what is like the remember. future of you in this? Like, what do you hope to accomplish with that? I'm probably gonna have to break up with him soon because I'm. Why do you not like nursery? Because the girls talk too much, and uh, when they don't eat salt, they talk. Okay, what about the boys? We we do it when we need to talk. Okay. Do they talk too much? Yeah. About what? They just talk to other girls too much. Like, they do it too loud when we're eating breakfast. Oh. Okay. Well, the boys probably talk as well. When, when we need to talk, yeah. What, when you need to? You only talk when you need to? Yeah. Yeah, that makes sense. But the girls, they just talk all the time? Yeah. That's annoying, isn't it? Yeah. You're goddamn right. One of Kylian Mbappe's friends needs to remind him that we must stay focused, brothers. 